It, it is uh, different uh, from anything we've done before. In the city, uh, we have these water tanks, and yet they're wonderful canvases, big, big buildings, highly visible, well-maintained, and it gives us an opportunity to really move them to the next level. So this is a great place to start that process. As, a, as my own personal project, this is probably the biggest piece I've done so far. I did a lot of research about animals that would be in this whole area that I could use to, would be related to water, you know, because it is a water tank. So uh, the otter was a cute little animal. I thought that it could make a big impact coming from the parkway. Right now I'm, I'm putting uh, reference marks and I basically I use these marks as a map for me to visually understand where this image is going to be. Time on the wall actually painting, I'm thinking about two weeks. Don't judge the process. Wait till it's kind of like starts to come together, then you'll kind of get the big picture of it. Right now, it looks kind of funky and weird, but it will start to develop. I think it's incredibly inventive. Uh, the use of the otter, of course, and, and the waterfalls and the whole idea of water and the importance of water to our lives and, and to the natural environment. And of course, we as a population are part of that environment and water is an essential element. We take it for granted. And this brings us back to sort of the natural uh, occurrence of water in the landscape and how important it is to our, our, our daily existence as humans, as animals. You know, we are part of that landscape. And I, I welcome this. It's a, wonder, it's a wonderful imagery.